A PLC has internal wiring and external wiring. Internal relays and terminals are connected inside of the PLC. We call this internal wiring. And external wiring refers to the connection between external devices and the terminals of the PLC. An input device works when it is connected between an input terminal and its COM terminal. When the input device outputs a signal, an internal input relay transfers the signal into the PLC. Similarly, an output device works when it is connected between a terminal and its COM terminal. Note that you need to prepare an external power supply used to drive the output device. In this way, DC or AC devices can be controlled according to COM terminal. Each terminal is allocated a device number like X0 or Y0. All internal devices are also allocated device numbers. For example, M0 is an auxiliary relay in the PLC, T0 is a timer, and C0 is a counter. Devices can be numbered in decimal, octal, or hexadecimal. Numbering system depends on the PLC. Decimal numbers produce a carry every 10 points. One zero is coming after zero through nine. Octal numbers produce a carry every eight points. One zero is coming after zero through seven. Hexadecimal numbers produce a carry every 16 points. One zero is coming after zero through nine, A, B, C, D, E, and F. It may take some time getting used to, but try your best to master this fundamental knowledge.